Russia's T-Zaggy working on double fuselage transport aircraft. The Zukovsky Central Aero Hydrodynamic Institute, T-Zaggy, continues to research prospective double fuselage transport aircraft, the institute said. A model of the aircraft with takeoff landing wing mechanisms in the form of gliding axis flaps was tested this time. Two types of flaps were considered, with direct and saw like back edge, it said. T Zaggy held experiments in the small subsonic aerodynamic pipe takeoff and landing regimes and airflow speed of 50 meters per second. The researchers exposed a favorable effect provided by saw-like back edge flap which decreased aerodynamic resistance during takeoff and landing. Previously TZAG experts studied the round flow of a model of prospective double fuselage aircraft and compared it with typical characteristics of single body craft. They determined the efficiency of the controls, altitude and direction fins. The obtained information will form a database of aerodynamic characteristics to create the control system of the aircraft. The advantage of twin boom, or dual fuselage design allows for a large central mounting point to be designed between the two fuselages. The lateral loading distributions can remain symmetrical, and thus avoid large rolling moments. The payload mounting point appears to be located near the mean aerodynamic cord of the aircraft. This is an extremely ideal design for an air cargo carrier. In a twin boom design, the vertical and horizontal stabilizers, greater stability and flight control forces can be achieved with two shorter, smaller surface area vertical and horizontal stabilizers. The larger the stabilizers and control surfaces, the stronger the design requirements are for the entire empennage section. The twin boom design allowed the designers to design a high aspect ratio wing with enough surface area to do some extra heavy lifting without making the airplane incredibly long in length. It is easier to design two shorter fuselages to remain stiff and meet design strength requirements than one extra long fuselage. Longitudinal weight and balance considerations are less critical in a shorter twin boom airplane than it would be if the Strato launch was a 300 foot long, single fuselage design. This is an extremely important consideration in a heavy cargo aircraft. Each of the three wing sections can have a shorter length and can be designed to be commensurately stronger and stiffer with less exotic engineering considerations, and or heavier materials in their structural elements. The next trial stage is scheduled in early 2019. Aerodynamic experts of the Institute will test adaptive wing mechanisms. The prospective double fuselage aircraft will airlift various Russian cargoes and soldiers up to 40 tons, including abnormal ones on an underwing suspension. The aircraft can be used as a spacecraft carrier. The project was designed within the state program to develop the aircraft industry in 2013 to 2025. Thank you for watching. Please like, share, comment and subscribe.